Buddy, I have got a, a great room full of people that I want to talk to you guys. This uh, We've got the Slot Cats. Slot cats, meow. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and what here's what's funny is that I want to introduce uh, slot cats to uh, Linda, and Linda and I have been working together for ten years, and mm-hmm. she took a break a couple years ago. She used to be head of marketing, and you know that turn event uh, thing that you guys went to, that was all her. She wow. she she came up with that and 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 did all that. So yeah. she's. You know, she's one of those people that I think, Linda, what was your, you, you were like one of the top 25 people to watch in the industry. Like, I guess. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been that. I guess. <laughs> I mean, yeah. So <laughs> I, that was a wonderful I, experience. That was, it was awesome. Oh, I'm so glad. And I'm so at, glad. We had, uh, it was a great, like we had a great time putting it together and just yeah. meeting everyone. And uh, honestly, didn't think that ever would have the opportunity to do something like that with just everyone with folks around the country so um i'm just so grateful yeah and uh linda i was um i think i I told you a little bit of that we had done this turn event uh you had done all these celebrity tournaments Mm -hmm. you had had all these celebrities you had like carrot top and a lot of the vegas celebrities well one of the years that you were gone we did um we did a a slot star tournament which uh and so Heidi and Fred were able to come and and it was madness. That's was, so that's so cool. It was crazy. That's so fun. And it was so much fun. Um I am uh the, I think Heidi Heidi and Fred, I think you were the first influencers that I ever interviewed for the first time we did this. I think it was oh. the first time and um I think so. And so there's so much that, that I want to talk about. You know, we we uh, we shut the channel down. We shut everybody play now. We yeah. shut it down when COVID came two years ago. Boom. We just, you know, everything kind of shut down. And so we we put the channel down, and we were kind of like we didn't even know whether to get on camera and say go to casinos because we were like we didn't know. Uh, mm-hmm. You know, uh, what was the last two years like for you guys? <laughs> um, well, we've done a lot of traveling. We've been. Uh, you know, go to casinos all over the country. We last, of course, once it reopened and everything. Yeah, once yeah. it yeah. reopened. Yeah. yeah. So the funny thing is, like a week before everything shut down, I, we won the biggest jackpot on our channel on eighty-eight cents. Uh, what? We over over twenty thousand oh, dollars on wow. eighty-eight cents, and uh, it was a really funny story. I was waiting to play bingo with the cool cat that came from Canada. Mm-hmm. And uh, that's our Patreon group. They support our channel. And yep. um, he flew in from Canada and he loves bingo. I love bingo. So I was waiting for him. I looked in the bingo hall. I swear I did not see him. Yep. I sat myself in the slot machine right <laughs> in front of the doors of the bingo hall. I was at home. <laughs> and $20 in the machine, nothing. Put a second 20 in the machine, hit 20 grand. Oh my God. And once I found out that he had bought in for bingo, I made it to bingo on time. <laughs> oh, you did. <laughs> Got paid and everything. That's how serious I am about it. <laughs> wow. So then, then of course, then the casino shut down about a week yeah. later. It was just, you know, obviously historic for everybody. Yeah. And um, so, yeah, kind of like you, Mike, you know, we were nervous about getting back into the casino and um you know wanting to show people how to do it in a safe manner right. you know and um you know not to be you know um irresponsible about it right. So, right. you know we went back safely mm-hmm. um then i think you know 2021 kind of was a turn of things and uh we started uh going out and traveling to different casinos we've been to Last um, August, we did a 10 day trip, yeah. um, three different casinos. We did meet and greets, group pools, slot tournaments. That's um, so cool. We did a slot tournament. They had, they had basically had beat the cats. So we oh, had really? to set the score and they had to beat us and they all got <laughs> fun, you know, prizes for the ones that beat us. Um, and then, and so that was super duper fun, but yeah, yeah. we've gone to Washington. We've gone to Oregon, California. Uh, lots of places. Iowa, Wisconsin. Yeah, Iowa, Wisconsin. Wow, and... you guys really. I mean, so it, it really hasn't slowed you guys down. Well, like, it, honestly. It's been a blur, but when it picked up for us, it picked, we it, running, it was yeah, just, hit the ground yeah, running. Yeah, hit the ground running. And um, so, yeah, and then uh, we, we, had, we canceled our Feline Fest during COVID. Mm-hmm. And then we had Feline Fest last year. Mm-hmm. 
Uh, and then we're having it in two weeks. Is it that soon? I think it's in two weeks, <laughs> two, maybe three weeks, really? less than three weeks. Uh, we're details, details. Tell us. We, we, oh, we, yeah. We're yeah. in Las Vegas. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, we have Feline Fest is for our Patreon group, our cat club. Mm -hmm. And we have cool cats coming in from all over the world. And we're meeting up what? at the Downtown Grand. And we'll have, uh, yeah, four days of events at Downtown Grand. Okay. And it's kind of like a little Feline Fest takeover of uh, downtown Vegas. So That's yeah, we just have a lot of fun and um, slot tournaments, group polls, live streaming. Right. Um, what else are we doing? I know. Oh, we do the scavenger hunt, which is really fun. <laughs> um so, so yeah. If you guys aren't busy, why don't you come on over? Come to Vegas. Yeah. <laughs> so tell Where, me about, tell me yeah, about some of like, these things. Right, yeah. I'm, I'm interested in the live streaming. So when yeah. are you guys live streaming? Cause I want to catch that. Okay. Where is it going to, like, when is it happening? What time, what day so we can, like, promote that? So we live stream every week on Tuesdays at okay. 5 p.m. Pacific. Every week on Tuesdays. Taco Cat Tuesday. It, yeah, it's called Taco Cat Tuesday. <laughs> right. um, one of our viewers uh, gave us a Taco Cat when we were in Washington visiting uh, a casino up in Washington. One of our viewers was like, you guys always talk about tacos. So he asked, Who doesn't love tacos? Thing. It's talking about is it's, adorable. That's great. It's the thing. We have oh. we've had taco cat cakes. Fried's bakery. From Fried's bakery, well the famous bakery. bakery here in Vegas. Oh my god. They made God, us a adorable. custom taco cat cake for one of our feline fest what? parties. I'll just hold them. And um <laughs> this came from another viewer for Fred's birthday, actually. Oh. <laughs> we have very generous, that. loyal uh yeah. viewers on our channel. And uh, but anyways, we live stream every Tuesday. Now, Feel Like okay. Us will be live streaming on a Friday night. OK. Uh, and we used to have Sunday mornings mm -hmm. we call it coffee with the cats because it was at 8 a.m. in the morning. I remember. Well, Fridays we call cat crawls. Yeah, Fridays were our cat crawls. <laughs> and we'd, we'd run all over Vegas. <laughs> yeah. Um, but so Sunday at Feline Fest, we will have coffee with the cats at okay. uh, 9 a.m. Yeah. yeah, we kind of changed Pacific. it a little bit. 9 a.m. Pacific. Uh, but that's another live stream, Downtown Grand. And uh, But typically, we live stream from a casino here in Las Vegas. And um, yeah. That's so cool. Yeah. I so, love well, that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell on Linda a little bit. Now, you, so she's a live streamer, too. She, <laughs> for the last oh. couple of years, she's took, taken some time off. And she was, she's a Twitch uh, streamer. You were. You've retired I were. her channel. Mm -hmm. And, okay. and you'll, you'll love the name of her, uh, of her channel. It was Calamity Cat. Nice. Oh, awesome. <laughs> I am a huge feline fan. I oh, love wow. cats. <laughs> right? Hi, Paul. Forever. Forever. I am wow. a crazy cat lady forever. <laughs> wow. So, yeah. So we uh, we have two rescues of our own. Mm -hmm. And um, they're, what, five now? Five or six. Now. Five or six now. Yeah. Keep yeah. But, yeah. I love my babies. They're like 14 and 17. Mm. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, that Mike hears me talk about them all the time. But as soon as I was like slot cats, oh, I I get that. <laughs> and you know, we uh, we end all of our videos with meow for now. <laughs> meow for now. <laughs> you can find me in a casino because I always wear cat ears. Oh, yep. that's I'm so cute. Yeah. yeah so uh, I don't. No, you <laughs> don't. <laughs> but uh, but yeah. So we we um, we didn't. We kind of fell into that, right? Yeah. How we got slot cats. Yeah. We came up with the name. You, we, you can either say it's a marketing genius approach or <laughs> it just happened. So I'll go with the genius approach. But <laughs> it really just happened. I love it. Yeah. I think it's I think it just fits perfectly. I think I love it. So how did you guys get into like what did you guys think the streaming part? Because that's what I'm like I'm fascinated about that, especially uh, since you guys have, you know, the YouTube channel. So did you guys think about you know, I'm going to do videos and then it just naturally progressed into the streaming or was it always something you guys thought we're going to do that one day? <laughs> um, no, we just kind of, <laughs> kind of fell into this. Okay. Um, I discovered one day. <laughs> yeah. Why don't you tell the story and I'll just be your arm candy. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, anyways, uh, Fred and I, always you know traveled to vegas we didn't mm -hmm. live here we live in vegas now but at yep. the time we did it and so we would always travel to vegas you know like for weekends extended weekends things like that and we were here one time i played a slot machine and i never got the bonus and if you know me <laughs> 
I usually play until I get that bonus. Mm. (laughs) Okay. But, um, but anyways, so, and we had to leave, we were going to, so we could make our flight. And I ended up a couple days later, I was in a hotel, uh, traveling for business. I was in a hotel by myself and I thought, I'm going to look up what that bonus is like, because it was just gnawing on me. And I found Brian Christopher and he had played the same game and he'd gotten the bonus. So I watched it. Yeah. And next thing you know, about five or six hours later, I wake up and my laptop is open watching Brian Christopher. <laughs> like, yeah. How many subs did he have then? Um, I think oh he God. had about 10,000. He had about yeah. 10,000. Wow. Like wow. I think we were, we were around him for his 10,000 yeah. celebration. Isn't that so crazy? yeah, it was very early on. Yeah, that's his crazy. Channel. Yeah. And anyways, so we, um, we met him out in Las Vegas and uh did a group poll with him and on the way home from vegas fred and i were talking and so fred um is is 100 disabled disabled mm-hmm. veteran and was kind of looking for something to do with his time and you know i was really busy and i thought well you know when we're in the casino why don't we just record our slot play he has a background in tv and film he did a lot of uh, worked on a lot of major motion pictures and tv shows and, and um, so I thought, you know, we have all the stuff at home. He knows how to do it, but we should just record. You know, we that's so hung cool. out with Brian, kind of, you know. And so that's kind of what we did, right? And yeah. Brian's been a big mentor for us, and he's helped yeah. us along the way. And, and um, you know, watching him live stream and being on one of his live streams is super duper fun. Yeah. So uh, when we got enough stuff, it just became like, it was like, let's do this. Um, yeah. So what most people don't know about me is, and it's kind of, this is kind of a, a shocking admission, but up until about maybe five or six years ago, I actually didn't like my picture being taken. Really? Really? Right. So like when you look at our family photos and you look, I'm the one taking the picture because I don't want to be behind the camera. Hmm. So, um, you mean behind the, or I didn't want to be in front of the camera. <laughs> in front, yeah, in front, right, right, right. I was with you. So uh, we, Fred and I went on a cruise and my son teased me about posting a bunch of selfies Yeah. while we were on the cruise. And I said, all right, hundred selfies coming up. And I did it mm-hmm. in a week. And that's how I kind of cured myself. So being live on camera was horrifyingly fearful for me uh-huh. um, when we first started. And I think I fangirled on our first live stream because a couple of... <laughs> Well, Brian came on the live yeah. stream. I just lost my mind. <laughs> and another big channel that I was watching at the right. time came on the live stream, and I like squealed, I think. And um, it was really funny. And uh, but now uh, through live streaming, there's such a community of people yeah. that mm-hmm. um, I enjoy just live streaming and talking to everybody in the chat. Mm-hmm. And just, you know, knowing that they're okay, like during COVID, it was such a scary time. And I, um, you know, we weren't live streaming, casinos were closed. And our, um, our Patreon group, I was reaching out to two or three people every single day Mm -hmm. and just messaging them like, Hey, how you doing? You okay? You know, how's the toilet paper situation going? Right. Yeah. yeah. God, exactly. what? That, I can't believe I, I can't believe that was a thing. Like, right? why was that toilet was paper shortage a thing? <laughs> I hate to admit it, but we we were we were flush in toilet paper yeah. during that time. <laughs> Who was it? <laughs> we had a ton of toilet paper. I don't know where the shortage was, <laughs> but um, it wasn't in this household. Uh, but anyway, so you know, and, and I, I had people give me feedback, like, thank you for messaging me. Like, I haven't talked to anybody in five days. Yeah. Isn't that funny? Because like, we, it, it, right when that time went, it, you know, when, when this community was communicating so much mm-hmm. on a daily basis, all of a sudden everything just went boom. Yeah. And so that kind of connection that you had with your Pantheon, you know, your, your slot, you know, your, your, your mm-hmm. community is, cool was cats. so important. Yeah. yeah. Cool cats. You know, you're, yeah. it, it must have been such a great comfort to, and a way to communicate with people because I got lonely. I was at home. Yeah. yeah. Well, so, you know, I, it, it really, I, I mean, I felt so grateful to be able to quarantine at home with Fred mm-hmm. and yeah. know that, you know, I had somebody here, you know, 24 seven and I wasn't alone or, you know, I mean, just the heartbreaking stories, like, you know, my son brings me groceries every Saturday and leaves them at the doorstep and I see him through the door, you know, I can't, mm. You know, 
you know, hug him or communicate with right. him other than, you know, through the door, through the window and, you know, all of that. So we started. We, we, got, we got a lot of those stories from people. Yeah, we started mm -hmm. Zooming with our group two nights a week. Wow. And then that turned into Saturday night virtual bingo because, again, I love bingo. <laughs> so um, I, we, Fred and I, we printed out cards off the Internet. We emailed them to everybody so everybody had cards. And, and we played bingo for a couple hours every week. Oh and just uh, we stayed in contact like that. And, um, you know, just really the, the channel, like, you know, again, it first started for our love of, of you know, that we like to gamble and we like to hang out together and have mm -hmm. meals and casinos and and take trips and things like that. But I think it really turned into um, just having this sense of community, that yeah. virtual community that we wouldn't have had any other way. Right. You yeah. know. Yeah. So, so yeah. So that's kind of where we got to today. Wow, that's really great. I yeah, mean, that's I, awesome. I love that. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, it's been a crazy couple of years. It has but, been. But I, you know, I feel like, you know, it's funny. It's like Brian. Brian went to Coeur d'Alene when Coeur d'Alene opened, mm -hmm. and you, all of you guys, were the ambassadors. You guys were a lot of the people when the when the casinos first started opening up. You were the people that were brave enough to get on the floor when there were just mm -hmm. masks and that's it. There was no vaccine and everything. There was just like you, you know, it took, I remember the first time I, I met up with Brian and in, um, in, in Durant, Oklahoma. And I was just like, I was, <laughs> I was like, I had that mask on. I was just like, I was like afraid of touching anything. Yeah. It was, you know, it was pretty dicey there for a while. So yeah. the yeah. first few months that the casinos reopened, Fred didn't join me in the casino. Yeah. Um, mostly because you were, at oh. risk, you were still at. I mean, you're an at risk. I'm an at risk. Um, um, person. You know, person with the underlying health conditions. So you know, it was really important that you know we put his health first. Right. And so I I'm kind still, of. I'm still wearing the masks. You know. Yeah. I do too. I do too. Like I, I just feel more comfortable, even if I don't need to, and if they say, "Hey, it's fine," I just, I don't know. I just, I think it's, I, I feel more comfortable. Yeah. yeah. And I still, when I'm live streaming, if somebody's playing a slot machine i don't sit at the one next to him yeah you know, i still try to keep that distance and and even though i know you know hey we're vaccinated and 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 everything mm -hmm. like that i just rather be safe than sorry mm -hmm. yeah. and you know um so yeah so you know we just uh when when we first went back you know it was it was you know a lot of hand sanitizing. i mean still today a lot of hand sanitizing yeah. Yeah. i brought wipes with me to wipe down um you know slot machines right um you know, just all that stuff. Just tried to be as careful as possible, and thank goodness neither one of us ever ever uh, had COVID. Not going to yeah, <laughs> yeah. Thank I goodness. It. But but yeah, it was you know some scary times you going back. He did. I got it. Yeah. I got oh, it. Yeah. Chris, I got yeah. it. Like right at Christmas time one year, it was just like Merry Christmas. <laughs> yeah, Christmas. I have not had it, so yeah. I've been lucky too. Like, yeah. but yeah, it's. I feel like it's. It, everyone has been like it's eventually it's going to happen right but um yeah so just being safe now and it's it's so different the the world in which we live today versus the world prior to like you wouldn't think about all the things that we used to do before it and look at it differently like i don't know they joke about you know blowing uh, the candles out on a cake mm -hmm. i can't even imagine today someone Spitting blowing the cake. candles out in a cake. I'd be like, cake. no. <laughs> right? Isn't that weird? Yes. So now weird. That, yeah. Now we think about that and we're like, why did we do that? <laughs> but things like that where you're, you know, it, it has completely changed uh, the way in which we view a lot of things. And just like you said, community is the another big thing that I took out. The most positive thing that I took out of COVID was this big sense of everyone want, really wanting to build this community with you know like-minded folks with people that they wanted to reach out to um and that's that's the big reason why i really started you know kind of getting really into the streaming when i did it was i i was realizing there was just so many people that wanted that connection mm -hmm. um and just wanted to you know just to reach out because the isolation was very hard for yep. a lot of people i agree well, yeah tell me a little bit about the cool cats tell me tell me about your folks like, like how many different places? I, I just think that's so great because I yeah, and it how how it's grown. Mm -hmm. uh, well, we're we're about uh, we're about almost 150 members in, in our Patreon. In the, you say Patreon, I say Clouder. Okay. A <laughs> Clouder. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, somebody's gonna have to look that up. But um, <laughs> just kidding. Uh, but yeah, so we have we call them cool cats, uh -huh. and, 
and um, they come from all over the world. We have people yeah. in Europe, we have people in Australia, uh, wow. Canada, all over the world. That's so cool. Uh, Singapore, everywhere. So, and of course, the United States as well. Yeah. And we, we just had our four year channel anniversary. Mm -hmm. Wow, congratulations. And, yeah, yeah. yeah. And happy we'll, anniversary. We'll That's so Thank cool. <laughs> That's great. Yeah. And and then our um our Patreon club is four years in September. September, right? yeah. yeah. Yeah, we started that way after. But we've had people, a lot of people that have stayed throughout the entire we don't expect everybody to stay in right. sure. Yeah. But we have a lot a that lot have stayed. Of very loyal people. Yeah. 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 Very supportive. Yeah. So, and you also, but you're also very involved in the other slot uh, channels. I see you moderating, because I'll, I'll jump on one of Brian's things, and all of a sudden I'm sitting there, and, and you're like going, hi, you're on, you're on there too. So you're very, uh, you know, you celebrate the entire community with everybody, mm -hmm. don't you? Um, yeah, I mean, we've gotten you're, busier. You're, you're not a mod for No, Brian, I'm but, not a mod for Brian, yeah. Okay. but yeah, he doesn't. I, yeah. I mean, not that we're not friends, we are, but there aren't any slot channels that mod for him. Okay. So yeah. he's had kind of, you know, uh, evolve to that but yeah. um but no i mean i certainly go on and support his mm -hmm. his live streams and you know say hi to people that i know again it's all part of that community and yep. there are people that um you know uh it's it's a opportunity for me to sit back and be in the chat and cheer yeah. him on and say hi to people when you know when i'm live streaming i'm I probably you know the the as you know the messages go by so quickly it does so, do. yeah hard to get everybody even though i do try very very hard but you always catch me everybody. you always catch me in there and you're like hey mike <laughs> yeah <laughs> always want to say hi to you yeah yeah well i just but, i it's been, you know, one of the things that we're doing is, so we're relaunching this and everything, and we're going to have uh, a lot of guests on more frequently because it's, we really think that you guys are more interesting, much more interesting than we are. So, so <laughs> I mean, that's true. I don't know. <laughs> Mr. Well, no, well, no, 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 but you guys, <laughs> right, you guys are right? in the, no, 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 but see, you guys are in the casinos and you guys are really playing the game. So, you know, and uh, so one of the things that we're going to be doing is we're going to be talking about other games too. So it's not just, it's not just an infomercial for every, that's one of the things right. we want, kind of like that. What are you? So, okay, so tell me on that big win that you got right before, what was the game? Yeah. Uh, Endless Treasures. Endless Treasures. Okay. What, what, and, and yeah. And so, what are your favorite games out there right now? Yeah. Woo. Favorite game right now? It does not have to be in every game. I, yeah. You know, yeah. I, like, we make good games. I know, but, right. but you know, it's, it's, so, it's, it's, it's anybody's. I still like Three Little Pigs, but, um, but that was every game. <laughs> <laughs> It's hard to find. I, 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 I did one of the voices for one of those pigs. They sped it up. Right. No, I, um, I think I did the, the surfer. I think every week on our channel, you will see us playing Udai Lian Lian, Panda or Dragon. Okay. Um, Gold Stacks 88. And Gold uh, Stacks Troy's, 88. Troy's Kingdom. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we love, uh, we, we dubbed it the bad game. And so I love the bad game. Yeah, we, we play it almost every time we're in a well, casino, for sure. Rumor on the street is that she dubbed it that nickname. Oh yeah, I think I was the first one to call it the bad game. You probably probably. I think that's so cool. Last last year when I was out with with uh, Danielle and, and 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 Brian, she was like going, she was calling it three bags, and she was like, go play that three bag game. <laughs> she was going, you're gonna like it, and I won a bunch of money. So. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, We're pretty lucky, fortunately. We are pretty yeah. lucky on that game, and then uh, we've had a couple hand keys on it too. So, yeah. um, Fred. Always gets the major on eighty-eight cents. Oh, wow, um, nicely. <laughs> so, but what what else is it? Any, any uh, other games? I don't know. We love Gold Stacks, Turtle Kingdom. That's one of our favorites for sure. Yeah. Um, what else? We, I mean, there's so many. You know, yeah. there's just so yeah. many. I know. Yeah. I know. It's hard to remember, but I, I just, you know, because I, I always want to kind of know what's what's hot and what's not out there. Um, yeah. and, and you know, I love the panda. You I love, love the wicked little panda. That panda is panda. so cute. It is cute. It is cute. <laughs> it is so cute. I was like, man, if I wasn't married to Fred, that panda would be running. I'm telling you. <laughs> that panda He's is really so cute. cute. Yeah. I'm calling Sandra Bullock right now. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, but, but yeah, no, we, we love, I mean, we just play all, all the games. We, well, and it's it's so much fun to play with you guys. I mean, I've, I've I've you know I watch on your channel and everything, and and you get so excited about so many of the features, and I love when you preview a game, um, and I always appreciate it when you guys play play our games, and, and you know, and and I learn from watching the other games too about mm -hmm. the games. So, 
Um, Very true. And we get a lot of people that say like, like I would have never played that game had I not seen you play it. Yeah. Now that I've seen you play it, I'm, I'm, I'm going to look for it in the casino. I'm going to ask for our casino to get it. Yeah. I love that. See, that's exactly like that's that's why what you guys do is so important and why we want to feature that and highlight that, because that that's exactly what we want to get to is a lot of times some players, you know, they're like myself. I I am that way, too, as I find a certain set of games and I just beeline to that. Mm -hmm. And I I don't even look at other ones because I'm like, but I like this one. Until someone says, "Hey, really look at this one," I I might give that a try. So that's why, you know, what you guys are doing is is awesome. Yeah, I think that like my favorite thing is to play a new game. Like I love new games when they hit the floor. I want to be the first one to play them. I want to figure it out, and um, I just like having. I I just play a lot of new games. There yeah. There are some channels that are known for uh, like playing a particular game mm-hmm. or a particular line of game, right. you know, lightning link or dragon link or anything mm-hmm. like that. That's definitely never going to be a slot cat. Um, what we're known for, because we just play so many right. different games. Yeah. And, um, you know, whenever, like, I think our video today, we previewed a brand new, our first time ever playing a new game. So I definitely love doing that. We always love it. We always love it when you guys play our games. We love it watching other mm-hmm. people's games. What has changed in the last two years since we last sort of liked it? In the what's changed as far as because casinos when when we did that 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 tournament for a uh, slot star tournament, I remember what I said to the, everybody. I because there was a room full of slot directors and I was going, you guys let them play on your floor because you guys were still getting a lot of resistance from some player uh, some some mm. casinos. What's changed as because uh, everybody's got to see that that you guys are bringing good news. Right. Um, I mean, I think for us, uh, I mean, it still takes quite a lot, a bit of effort, to get, mm-hmm. but once we meet the right people, mm-hmm. um, they're more open to it. And I think some yeah. seats are changing in the, uh, casinos as far yeah. as uh, old guard stepping out and yeah. more welcoming the, the live streams. And I have to thank the slot manufacturers because they have opened so many doors for us. Absolutely. Mm. Um, you know, We've done we've done world premieres of games. We did the world premiere of Willy Wonka Dreamer of Dreams at Circa. That's great. That's Derek, awesome. You know, Derek Stevens cut the ribbon and we sat down and played. He liked my jersey. He did like <laughs> that. <laughs> that is so um, cool. I love it. And yeah, and so you know, um, Scientific Games, uh, well now Light and Wonder, they've yeah. uh, you know really really opened the door for us. We had another manufacturer that reached out to us and wanted us to preview their games and. And 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 they opened the doors for us at casinos that we couldn't get into before. Right. Right. Yeah. Now, uh, one casino in particular, they they have like it's now open recording, and there's tons of slot channels going there. Yeah. That's amazing. And, um, I love to hear. Not that. even on the strip. So yeah. it's just bananas, right? Yeah. yeah. But um, but yeah, I mean, I think between the slot manufacturers and. Um, you know, helping the influencers and just getting into some of these casinos. Mm-hmm. When we first started, there was pretty much one casino here in Vegas that all the YouTubers went to. Yep. Okay. They were the I only know. ones that were allowing open recording. Right. And and now we have tons of choices. Right. But I, so, I have to thank you, Mike, because you were mm-hmm. one of the first oh, advocates that really came out. I'm sincerely from mm-hmm. heart. Very true. That's awesome. Well, yeah. I, I, I have been a huge fan from the very beginning. It was, you know, as a game developer or when I, when I was developing games. Sorry. That's okay. Uh, when I was developing games, you know, uh, and I'm being, I'm geographically challenged in Austin, Texas. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, you guys were my eyes and ears. Mm-hmm. So are for a lot of things. Yeah. So. Yeah. But um, anyway, so I am so excited that we got to, t- <laughs> to talk um, Our cats were sad because we had the door shut. Oh, okay. So oh, that go. happens. I know. I can't. I can't. Like, I'm. All, I'm always <laughs> worried that they're going to start like yelling at me, and I, I can't. I can't leave them out because if I do, they'll start. You can hear yeah. them. Like, yeah. they are just loud. Well, there. You'll hear them now. We opened the door for them. <laughs> they were mad because the door was shut. <laughs> totally get it. Well, you guys, I am so glad that we've had this time to 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 um, to regroup. Um, I want you guys to stay on a little bit because we want to talk to you a little bit more. But you guys out there, um, 
I love the slot cats and um, and have since you know the very first time I started watching them on 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 uh, thing. We want to we'll put some information down below for links. Uh, yes. And uh, so that you can find out where they're where they're going to be and what's going on. And I think that we want to have them back on a regular. Yes, basis we do. To Absolutely. Kind of, to kind of Absolutely. talk about and to promote things. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> there's another step. Oh, uh, the third slot cat just left. Okay. Oh, I was just going to say, I think we're going to get a, we're going to get a guest star. <laughs> guest star is going to jump in, but uh, Heidi and Fred, thank you guys so much. Linda, thank you. Uh, I, I'm, I'm loving doing this. With you. <laughs> nice to meet you, Linda. Thank oh, it's great you. meeting you guys. Yes. Okay. And what do we say at the end of our videos? Uh, meow. Meow, meow for now. Meow for now. Okay. There you go. <laughs>